Good morning, good afternoon, good everything, wherever you're from. Today, we changed the oil on Tina's and Six Foot's bike. <gasps> I forgot the chain lube, bro. I ordered it on Amazon and we're primed, but because we live in some crappy ass city, uh, it's just not gonna come today or tomorrow. I ordered it yesterday. It's like seven days prime, which makes no sense. This is literally the only motorcycle all they had. So this is what I'm doing right here. The castle, bro, I don't really care. As long as the bike works, right? Let's see if my, uh, my beautiful little girl still turns on. Oh yeah. Unfortunately guys, this channel is unmonetized. Now I have to reach like some crazy amount of hours slash shorts or whatever. So I'm trying to pump out as much as I can. Realistically guys, you got to monetize your channel, your audience and whatever you do somehow to make it a proper full-time kind of thing again. I'm confident I could do it. I'm just trying to figure it out. All I ask from you guys is just support and that's it. Like that's all I could ask for. I will enable channel memberships to where I could chat one-on-one -on -one with you guys and like privately in like a more private group on YouTube. And those channel members will have perks, but I don't think I could do that until I hit some certain amount of views or some stuff so just just enjoy the videos to be honest guys i haven't changed the oil on this bike in a very long time i'm scared to see the oil level i also need to get a cloth because i got no idea Ugh, this thing takes forever to screw in i like tina's bike better when it comes to changing oil because i'm pretty sure as soon as i take this off it has like a little window a see-through window and you can literally see how much oil is in your bike and there's a level thing uh, there's a level thing there this has got a dipstick. This is just like, kind of like, hey, there's a level. If it matches, you're good. Okay, let's sit down. Let's go finish the fries. I'll help you. So the plan was to change the oil. Literally, I, I changed my shirt. It got hot and all that. And the, the plan was to do it, but I got hungry. I just remembered I don't have the oil pan, the, the funnel. Make sure you don't press any screens, okay? Oh, you're a good camera girl. You do see all the motorcycles. Uh-oh, the bee is getting into our Taco Bell. He's dead. Oh, he's not dead. Oh my God, he's gonna sting me. Oh, I don't know, run. Maybe she's here. So when I did get into this car, the mount fell off. So hopefully this mount doesn't fall off while driving because my windows are open and it's right next to the window. So I don't want that shit to jump out. You know what I'm saying? Damn, Tina Park real bad today. Holy. We're gonna drive by the lady that yelled at me that one time and see if she yells at me again. One thing I wanted to say, I don't want to give it away. I'm going to be streaming. And the idea I have when I actually fully commit to that, I'm not doing it until I know I can do it every single week, but it's gonna be fire bro listen somebody's made fun of me for having little trees i'm only keeping it on here because it's black and it kind of matches the interior of the car do you not know how to use a roundabout what is he doing the, the guy next to me laughed when i said that because it's true and another thing six foot karen is complaining about right now roundabouts people do not know how to use roundabouts oh my goodness doing one of these. Yep, same girl from last time. She literally gave me the biggest cut I just right now because same girl from like two days ago that was like yelling at me for going too f Bro, this car is either a magnet for Dumbos or I'm wrong. I don't know, but I swear that last time I saw her, I was not going fast. All right, back to my babies. Actually ended up buying, it's in the house right now, but I ended up buying a random brush, because they don't sell chain brushes apparently where I went, and chain lube, which I'm just gonna return the ones that are on Amazon, because if you take a look, the funnel's coming today within, I don't even know if it's focused or not, but the funnel's coming in within 45 minutes, which is never accurate, so I'm a little scared. The oil pan is coming tomorrow, which was the, the or which was ordered the same time as this, but Prime is lame. The brush is also coming tomorrow, which are getting returned, so pan and brushes are getting returned. The, oh, the lube, the chain lube is supposed to come on Monday, bro. Today is Wednesday. And then for, I don't know, Tito orders some Maybelline looking ass. On top of that, we actually were testing out if we could take this off without damaging the bike. And we actually can. Okay, new day, new me. All right, so listen up, guys. Oh, the oil is still going. It's still pouring out of the bike. That's insane. Listen, all right, so me being me, because I'm me, I ended up... Uh, thinking this was enough. No, it's not. There's a full one right here. I had to put my hands in all the oil because I wasn't wearing gla uh, gloves. And I had to um, <laughs> make a quick switch. It's just a mess. And I burnt myself because I started the bike. I burnt myself right here. So <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Listen, this isn't even the worst part. This is not even the worst part, okay, Myla? Let me, <laughs> I know you got it. Let me help you. The worst part is this way. Myla, we're gonna show them the worst part of today, okay? 
Listen, this car has been through hell and this is definitely fading. So we got to replace that as well. The worst part is that I completely forgot that I was at my dad's house picking up the broken Ford Explorer and I brought an oil pan. The entire time I had this in the car and I was using kitchen pans. So now I got to pour this <laughs> and this into these. I don't even know how to throw out oil, but I should have used this the whole time because it even has a nozzle to pour oil out. I don't know how I'm doing this, to be honest. Oh, sweet. So it says the... Uh, no, no, you're joking me. You're actually kidding me. Arriving now until 12 p.m. And the Amazon driver is, I, I swear to God, if this comes now as I'm doing the oil change, I'll be actually extremely upset. You're actually joking me. Oh my goodness, you strong lady. Show them what you got. It's the oil pan. Yeah, she loves showing her muscles. <laughs> what are the chances, bro? My luck is insane. I need your help again. I need another bottle. Quick, quick, this one, this one. You got it? Thank you. Okay, listen, princess, you ready to turn on the bike to see if daddy did a good job? Louder or longer. <gasps> Yay, high five. High five, woohoo. All right, we've switched a few things. I, first of all, I switched kids. Myla's inside on her laptop. She got hot and tired. Winter is out here with me, the dog, so she's pooping right now. But listen, 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 let me tell you something, though. Once you have kids, man, you don't realize it because with, without kids, you're pretty much like, whoa, it's just like fine time. No, you can't. I've been changing the oil on the bikes for like three days now. Tina's working, can't even help me with this. So I got to, the stand for the for the rear tire um, is like the, the pegs or whatever are stuck on the, um, on Tina's 600. So I'm forced to kind of figure this out by myself. I'm just gonna do what I think is the smartest way to change or to, to lube a chain. Start over here. And then slowly, I don't want to get it on the tire though, that's the problem. Guys, I'm not gonna lie, this was a horrible idea. I ruined my driveway, but let's move on. All right, hopefully this isn't permanent. I got no idea. This is literally the only one I could find in like a bunch of Canadian tires, chain lube by Lucas, which I heard is good, but I don't know. This thing to chain, uh, to grease or to, to kind of clean and, and grease up and lube the chain. This is like the only thing that, is, that I've found useful for chains. If you have any other suggestions, let me know. But I kind of want to make my own kit and start selling it um, because this is ridiculous. Like Canadian Tire doesn't have it. Walmart doesn't have it. It's all from like Amazon or China. Right now I'm over stressing. I got to clean the bike too. There was a company that sent me a bunch of power washing things and uh, I never got a chance to do a video and I kind of feel bad because this was like five years ago or something. That was like in the middle of me kind of quitting or taking a break. Let me shake this up. And I found it in the garage. It's just like a foam gun. The detail, so let's just see if it works. I would love to work with them again if this thing still works. I don't know, Max Shine, I don't know if they're still in business, but they sent me an entire bucket of stuff and I really do feel guilty for not really sharing any of this. Oh, well, let's see, I'm gonna press the on button. Well, that's a good sign. Nope, up here, up here, <laughs> see I. You're being shy again. Well, started in the morning and now it's four o'clock and we're still, Myla's got no shoes. Daddy figured out what was wrong with the foam gun. The outlet wasn't working. It's not really foaming. All right, this is embarrassing, but this is my first time using this type of thing or even detailing anything. First of all, everything worked from Max Shine. It was me not even turning on the water on the side of my house. We foamed it, we rinsed it. The kids were having fun. And if you're viewing this, you're the coolest person in the world. Your job is to wipe down daddy's whole bike. Your turn. You don't gotta ask me twice. Okay, start wiping daddy's bike down. You get the other side, G. All right, putting you to work. As you guys could tell, it took about three or four days, six different shirts and three different kids and, and all that just to change the oil of a bike and wash a bike. So I love you so much. Peace.